Yeah, but really, your mom shouldn't have been doing that. She's a married woman. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to a, another Modern Cube Draft here with Mike B. You okay? <laughs> What's the matter? All right. Drinking some clear milk. I wished Andre Mangucci a happy birthday on Facebook yesterday. That was fun. Andre Mangucci is probably one of my favorite uh, Magic players. Uh, nicest dude. I, actually, it's funny. I remember when um, when I top the Pro Tour, I was back in like when you get like on, on Sunday on day three, uh, when you're waiting for your top eight round, you get like there's a backstage area. And they have like food. They have breakfast all made out. Like it's like a super nice breakfast. It's like cooked eggs, you know, bacon, potatoes, toast, fruit, all kinds of things. Basically like a whole spread. And uh, they do the same thing for lunch. Like after the first two rounds of the first round, they take the breakfast out and they bring in lunch. So they cater your whole meal all day for the top eight players. And I was in there and everybody gets two guests. And Andre was like, hey, have you do you have, have you used your two guest spots? And it's sad, sadly, at this Pro Tour, I just went by myself. I was I was literally just on my own. Um, and so Andre was like, hey, man, can I, can I use one of your spots to come hang out with you guys? And I was like, yeah, definitely, dude. Come on back. And so Andre, I'm going to get you to use one of my guest slots to uh, come back and hang out with everybody at that top eight which is pretty sweet that being the case what's our pick man <laughs> i don't know if you guys heard did you, that did you hear that gargle i bet if you can watch the replay you can hear it real loud perfect fits pad kid pad kid poured card pulled i don't i'm gonna read that after i pick what's the pick Steve wildfire Men? let's go let's go crazy no we're not doing that what about bloodstained mire bloodstained mire is that better than steam vents probably not but maybe I'm just gonna take steam vents. I want to be Grixis. Oh, watery grave! Wow, it's like I said I want to be Grixis, and they're just like, here you go. This is also a great Grixis pack. I imagine some of these will come back. Uh, pad kid poured car curd pulled cod ten times fast. Ten times fast? Do you mean you want me to say it ten times fast? Because you didn't say that you want me to say it. Did they also have monkey butlers backstage at the top eight? No, not at this one. I think in some of the uh, some of the Eastern top eights they do where monkeys are more prevalent. I'm home sick today and my dog has been sleeping with me on the couch. She went to roll over and instead slowly fell off the couch. She hit the floor and looked super confused as to how she got there. Then went back to sleep. That's a good dog story. Solid dog story. Do you think it's water grave? Sure. We're going to take a water grave. Oh, look at this. <laughs> are you looking? Ooh, we can get our lands that we have no spells. Who cares? Why do we need spells? Fair. You know what I like better than spells? casting the spells well currently we're casting zero how much would, we, would someone have to donate for you to squirt this in your mouth how much yeah do i get the donation uh we'll split it <laughs> it's mine it's the, the the vehicle is mine right so like if you want 30 bucks we'll do 50 bucks well, we'll do 60 40 you'll get 60 i'll get 40 to squirt this in your mouth or you know you guys can choose we also have we got a mango peach which one is mike squirting in his mouth and how much are we talking Berry Sangria. We got a bunch of little little crystal lights down here. <coughs> wow. Let's pick your hostage taker. Yeah, that's good. I like hostage taker. It's a big boy. Also a Doom Blade and a Murderous Cut. And a Lava Cut's Claw better. If we're going to take one. How much to mainline some Mio? That's what I'm saying. No, main, no, that's much different. I have a story about Mio. Listen to my story about Mio energy squirts. Okay, I'm listening. I'm homesick today and my Mike B has been sleeping with me on the couch. <laughs> wow. For 50, will he open it up and chug it? Wow. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm gonna time out. I'm taking this lava claw reaches, man. Holy shit! <laughs> he just—it's the same story, but he replaced. I know time. what he did. I was here for it. Oh, that's such chaos. That's good stuff, man. <coughs> Got him. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to take this as a charm. 
You feel like you're you okay with this so That's far? good. Yeah, yeah. All right, here's here's Nick's story. Mikey Golf, you've heard of the name. I know, yeah. This dude used to squirt it into his mouth on a regular basis. He called it Riding the Dragon. Oh, all right. Well, that can't be the end of the story, I'm sure. What about Sweltering Suns? Um, I think it's I probably really better than Walking Ballista. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well, Black Sun Zenith. Isn't that just a worse Sweltering Suns? No, it keeps coming back, man. And you can do it for any number. <laughs> Take it. I don't care. See if I care. About your stupid sweltering sons. <laughs> skin render. I like skin render. Does it like you back? <clears throat> it's hard to say. I, I sent them the note that says check yes or no, and it didn't do it. You think Zenith is better than sweltering sons? I don't know. Maybe. If you have a million mana, maybe. At the office, we had a challenge or something called the Hardcore Belt. The challenge was called the Hardcore Belt? That sounds more like what you'd win from the challenge, not what the challenge actually is. I don't want to borrow Signet in this deck. Uh, Fatal Push is nice. Wildfire. We're not wildfiring, you maniac. Oh, Why look. Not? Whoa! Gear Hulk, they all came back. and Vampire. Jeez. Well, we're not Salt Eye, so I think it's either Gear Hulk or Nighthawk. We don't have to be salt eye. Like you just add green. Oh, or you add blue right. Yeah, yeah. I still think it's gear hawk, a gear hawk, gear hawk or night hulk. Gear hawk or night hulk. I like night hawk better. Night hulk. Night hulk. Hey, look, another titan. I think it's actually the titan here. Yeah. Was there? Wait, where was the different titan? Is there another titan? The hulks are kind of titans. I guess the gear hulks are kind of titans. Yeah. Oh, I like manic vandal a lot. That's the main deckable card. Oh, banefire. I like Banefire more than Repeal here. Banefire could just kill some dudes. This is like a Kessig Wolf run that you just don't have to have a creature for. That's not accurate at all. <clears throat> totally accurate. Okay, so... At the office, you could challenge people to do anything for a chance to win it. You challenge people and win the belt. Yeah, no, I get that. I had to ride the dragon for a chance to win the belt. And let me tell you, it tastes like shit. Everything tasted like metal afterwards. Yeah, Mike has done it before. I have done it before. He squirted it in his mouth before. How was it? Uh, I don't know if everything tastes like metal. It was just very, 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 very sour. Nick, how much did you put in your mouth? All right, girlfriend just got back. She's butthurt. I'm on the couch. Uh-oh, she didn't like my excuse. I'm hanging out with Frank. That's rude. <clears throat> oh, I like a Snapcaster. Over um, Nixie? I didn't even see him because he doesn't have colors. He doesn't have arts. Yeah, I think still so. Maybe I like Ob better. I don't know. A three-second squirt? Is that a lot? One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi? Yeah, that's pretty long. Huh. He touched it. He's seen it. Did I say that? <laughs> I don't remember saying that. It's either... I think it's one of these two. Well, someone has to offer up the bucks for me to squirt. <laughs> I bet this guy comes back, dude. People don't respect Ob. I think that's obvious. Got him. Do you remember that time that, um... You know what? Shut up. <clears throat> Dreadboard? Drowned Catacomb? Huh? Glenelange Archmage, huh? I like Archmage. I do too. I bet one of these comes back. Ob isn't even the best walker in the box with his exact mana cost. That's why... What is that? In the box? I don't know what that means. Looking for some hot stuff. Maybe this evening. What if I squirt this into my mouth? Canned air? <clears throat> yeah. Can you flip it upside down first? No, oh, definitely. <clears throat> Who's a better walker than Ob with his exact mana cost? I definitely don't think it's Lillian on Death's Majesty. That card's not good at all. Yeah, that card's poop. I'm pretty sure Ob is pretty strong. 
Sahili Rai. I was really hoping this was Ral Zarek. I just saw the colors. I thought you didn't say colors. Shut up. Fuel mug. No, it's Zealous Conscripts, bro. What if you get your Kiki? Then you'll have a Jiki. Oh, he's in the same pack. They're in the same pack. They're in the same pack. No. <clears throat> and don't squirt canned air in your mouth. Most have a bittering agent in them to deter people from, from huffing it. That's Yeah, that's actually true. I think it sells conscripts here. I don't want no triple red card. And if the Kiki Jiki comes back, that's just cool. That's just cool. <laughs> Nobody wants that fat little donut. <laughs> Maybe that's true. I like Jace Boy. Really? Over like Terminate? Actually, Cloud Skate's better. Then Terminate? Yeah, dude, it's a it's a guy. This kills any creature and we have a snapper. No, we do have a snapper. That's a good point. Take and Terminate, you stupid nerd. Oh, mind control. There ain't nothing close to that. Don't even try to act. I didn't even look. Pia? Pilgrim's Eye? No, Barrel's Expertise. Really? It's bonkers. Is it bonkers? All right, we're going to play it, but it better be bonkers, okay? It bounces three perms. Oh, well, artifacts are creatures, not permanents. Like, I think it bounces planeswalkers or something. Oh, that's worse. Oh, wow, he had no idea. He thought the card <laughs> was bonkers and actually doesn't know what it does. Here we are. I just thought it was non-land permanents. Ooh, oh, there's the better version. Also, is it Signet? Yeah, but I, it's a really? I don't think Cyclonic Rift is that strong in this cube. Actually, that's been it wins my the game. It doesn't though. Yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. There's a lot more one for one trading in this cube, so you don't actually have opponents with board states that have a bunch of things. Uh, typically, they've played them fairly, <clears throat> so they can usually just recast them again the next turn. Uh, it's not like the Vinci's cube where you churn a bunch of things out really quickly with other things, right? Like, you're not pl pay playing a gr Grim Monolith and a Worn Power Stone, then an Ugin, and then you bounce all their stuff and they can't redo it in one turn. Uh, it's more it's more like that they're just playing things fairly and, and one for one -ing. I actually like Champion of Wits here, I think. Oh, the Ob didn't come back, but the Sarkon did. Yeah, it's fine. Vizier... <clears throat> Oh, we have the barrel and the bar barrel's expertise. Look at that. The barrel and his pertease. And his pertease. Mm -hmm. We didn't take Massacre Room just because we're uh, not that heavy black. I like Serum Vision probably more than Bells and Lock. I don't, I don't like that I like it more, but I do. What are you doing, man? What am I doing? You don't want to play that Lutero Core main? Maybe, actually. I think it's fine. <clears throat> I'll get you my perties. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. <clears throat> oh, look, a Harbinger. You want to play that guy main too? Want to no. play all the two drops main? No, I don't like bad cards. Wow. Oh, there's Gristlebrand. Is that a bad card? Unfortunately, this cube he is. You'll never cast him. <clears throat> I don't know what to take here. Dissolve? Is Delver good enough yet? No. Delver is never good Is he enough. ever good enough? No. No, I don't think he's ever good enough in cube. You have to really skew your deck. Look at the number of cards that would flip a Delver in our deck. Rip, fat donut boy. Indeed. Seven? Do we have two on a flats nearby? Yes, we do. I'll take a Dissolve. I like a Dissolve. We have multiple T1 of flats been nearby. One per citizen. One per citizen, yeah. That's how it's the quantity of T1 of flats we have. One per citizen. Hey, look, it's big Snapcaster Mage. It is. More like big Caster Mage. It's also Solemn Simulacrum. And I even like Negate here. Negatu? I like Solemn Simulacrum. How do you feel about Solemn here? He's a fine card. Is Gearhulk just better? What are the what are the things we can actually hit with a gear hulk in our deck? Not a ton of things. Yet. 
Well, it is pack three. This one's always solid. You can't really go wrong with it. What if you can, though? I don't think you can. Mm, but what if? <clears throat> Tijuana Flats is definitely not our go-to place for tacos. A uh, place called Carmelita's is usually our go-to. And then I think Taco Bus is second. And then Chipotle is third. Wait, what happened? What's our go-to place for tacos? Probably Carmelita's. That's what I said. Oh, oh yeah. The payoff. It's your boy. Yeah, that's an easy pick. Oh, Rakdos' return is also nice. <coughs> yeah, that card wins games. We got the Ravenous Chupacabra, too. Choo it's Rakdos' Choo return, doo -doo -doo. Right? Yeah. I think it's better than Banefire. I like Roast. Actually, it is. It's basically just Banefire, but that discards cards instead. Roasty McBoasty. Roasty McBoasty. Roast over never returned? Yes, because we're not that heavy black. We literally have two black cards. <clears throat> and I want to have ways to deal with early creatures, not necessarily late creatures. I guess we have a Terminate and Fatal Push, but those aren't double black. Like, our black is very light, admittedly. Yeah. Yeah. I just don't think this card is good in this cube. Like, there's so many cards in this cube where I'm like, you do not fit here. You do not belong. I think it's just Vampire Hex Mage, even though I'm not even going to play it. It's decent against Planeswalkers, I guess. I mean, yeah, but how do we get Gristlebrand in the graveyard is the problem. I guess we can Is It Charm it? I don't know. You take that Crocodile Zombie. <laughs> we can take the Crocodile. We can also get Explosion Expansion. <clears throat> How many X spells do we want to have? Well, we'd only have two if we did this. Which is too, too many. It's not. Oh, Sword of Feast and Famine? It's eighth pick? Weird. Yeah, it seems fine. Nightfell Spectre came back? Dang. I'll play that guy. Alright, we need multiple cuts here. Cut the sword? Yeah. Do we not cut the sword? I don't think so. I'm going to cut the Sweltering Suns for now. That makes sense. I don't think Barrel's expertise is that great, but I don't know. <clears throat> you missed my just barely entertaining story. Hold on. Where did it go? I came into realization today I've been watching you too much. I know this because I caught myself clearing my throat a bunch, even though I don't need to actually clear my throat. It's entirely a learned tick. That's interesting. Huh. I like Batter Skull more than like Sarkon, actually. Yeah. That's really weird. I wonder wonder if that's why I do it. I think you do it because you're stupid. You think you do it? You think I do it because I'm because you're stupid? You think I do it because you're stupid? No, you're stupid. You're stupid. Yeah, you're stupid. You are. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You didn't get anybody. All right. Well, we got a bunch of playables here. I think we can take the barrel's expertise out. Fine. You didn't even know what this did. You thought it was three permanents. You thought it was three boomerangs. Well, boomerangs can bounce lands. I said non-land permanents. Thank you. Yeah, get, get roasted. I think Manic Vandal can go in the sideboard for now. Just cut the barrel's expertise. Fine. Just do it already. Yeah. Yeah. Looter with a sword's pretty good. Yeah. Looter with a sword. Lo looter with a sword. That's my story. I guess it's not a story. <coughs> I think it's because I get like a tickle in my throat and I'm like, oh, I just need to clear it out. Oh, I get a little tickle in my throat. There's a little worm in there that goes. Tell us more about the worm in your throat. 
That's the worm in your throat. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, is it now? So what is this? Four, five, six, seven black sources. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eight, nine, ten. We can go to nine here. Two, three, four, five. We can go to six. Nailed it. And we have an is it signet. Nailed it. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven black sources. I think that's actually fine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, How six. long are you streaming today? How long can this go on? To the end of time. <clears throat> yeah, I'll actually be streaming until the end of time, so. You got some time. You can you can catch catch it. Catch the catch the fever. <laughs> you alright? Well, you know what they say, Frank. Heavy is the head, the crown. That was a classic quote from you, man. Yeah, I know. That's why I got me. I know I know why I got you. Only four instants. Yeah, which is why I didn't love Torrential Gear Hulk. This is a good one. The hand? Yeah. H heavy is the hand that draws the cards. <laughs> oh, well, we're definitely bringing in Sweltering Suns, that's for sure. He'll never get ten perms. Come on. Do we want Nighthawk? I think we want both of these, actually. Yeah, I like them. Keep in mind, fetch lands. Tell me more. Don't mess it up. I don't even. I want to play double black, so I don't even want to fetch land you. I'm just mobile. saying, don't mess it up. I'm just saying, don't mess it up. Look at all these little little nerds he's playing. They're called dirt burgles. They're called dirt burgles. You know, I don't think they are dirt burgles. I heard dirt burgles. I heard. <laughs> well, maybe you should see a doctor about that. I hear dirt burgles. Excuse me, doctor. I hear dirt burgles. Marshall. Oh, I see. You're going extremely mm. wide right now. <clears throat> well, now we're that's gonna, a card that's we're hard We're probably going to gonna skin render this. Although Nighthawk's a pretty solid answer to that. I know. Bup, 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 burgle in the jets. <laughs> Remember when we took a Savannah instead of a Sphinx Revelation? Oh, I don't God. think we'll ever forget that. Hashtag never forget. If they actually play a land and a spell, they actually do have a flying guy. If they play four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, great. Really? Very aggressive. Well, <clears throat> see you later. Michael and the Jets. I think we have the Nighthawk to start dealing with these guys, but then maybe they make a thing. I think it's still our best play. Well, we could play Batter Skull. Mm -hmm. Gets us four next turn. But we have to block here, and then we take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Actually, we don't have to block there. We can block. We'd have a Batter Skull, so we could block here, chump here, or we can just block here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got a two. They have two cards in hand. Uh, we're definitely. Oh, because if they make an emblem. Yeah, you're right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we'd be dead. <clears throat> so B Skull is not an option. They emblem. You're dead. You're still dead to any removal spell, pretty much. You're dead to any. Your mom. You're dead to any of your mom. Got him. Did you? Well, I guess it's official now. Yeah, Joji said so. Oh, they're gonna emblem anyway. Well, that's gonna that's not something that props can fix. Block here we take three, four, five, six, seven. So we have to block here and and a nerdle. Nerdle McBurdle. <clears throat> Three, four, five, six, seven. Interesting. 
So this seems fine because next turn we can play Batter Skull. Oh, you're just gonna play another thing. That's fine. I think we need to survive long enough to have got Batter Skull to Glenlander Archmage. 6-6 six, six Vigilance Lifelink Flyer is pretty good. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. Never don't have it. I'd say that was a pretty good draw. That was a pretty good draw. Fire Spout and Sweltering Suns can come in. <clears throat> Alright, so now we're going to take out a black and a blue and add two more red we can also bring in oh cunning spark mage doesn't seem terrible either take out the sword they're mono white take out the gear hulk you're super slow take out the rakdos's return bring in a spark mage take out the serum visions bring in a burst lightning yeah that seems good messy borders, borders yeah <clears throat> Mind Control and Zealous Conscripts also don't seem great. I'm just going to bring in all the removal. We're just going to burn so... We're going to burn so bright. You could also bring in Searing Blaze and take out the Bolas. Uh, I want the Bolas. Why? Because I want to win the game. I mean, you can win the game with other cards. Fire Spot doesn't hit Flyers, but it hits Ground, guys. What did you say to me? I'm a dad. I mean, the only thing it wouldn't hit last game before they played Flicker Wisp was Spectral Procession. So it would have hit Thalia, it would have hit uh, the Token, it would have hit the 2 1. I'm a dad. I don't want Blaze just because it's double red. Like, I know Sweltering Suns is also double red, but it's not as cheap, so I'm not going to have. I don't know. It, it's also probably fine, but if we don't have a land, it's a bad top deck. Like, there's lots of reasons why. Kill it! <clears throat> kill flyers if we pay green well that's annoying oh actually no it's oh we don't have a blue i that's really sad seems good this is how we die ironically we do have double red though yep that is hard to deal with Oh, good games. Good times, good times. No blocks. <clears throat> it's almost like a joke at this point. Oh, boy. Just realized who I was playing against. Heart. <laughs> uh, yep. I mean, it's only turn five, though. It's only turn six, so it's reasonable that we don't. Yeah. All right. Good games. I had fun. Everybody had fun. We go to six. Missed four land drops. And uh, don't get to play Magic the Gathering. But I had a good time. Did you have fun? Yeah. Yeah, it was a great time. Me too. Good times. Good times. Felt like it was a very fair match. Everyone played their cards. We did draw a lot of our sideboard cards. That is true. Cunning Spark Mage, Burst Lightning, Sweltering Suns, and Fire Spout. Magic's like, did you need this? I think you boarded this in. It'll probably be helpful. immensely keepable I feel like I'm always losing to the white decks you had all those cards yes in my hand oh well the thing I didn't have is lands unfortunately I 
I don't know. I mean, like, your your Adanto Vanguard is still hard to deal with for us. But, I mean, like, if we can land a Batter Skull at some point or, like, just actually play Magic the Gathering, like, maybe we're, maybe we're in the game, which seems important. But. What can you do? Mow. Wow. I wonder if how wonder how loud I saw you doing it, so I, was, I synced up with you. It's a sync cat. Yeah, Brawler Bear, good games, buddy. Nevertheless, good games. What did you say? It's what kind of cat? Good, good talk. I don't know what you're doing right now, besides being a super weirdo. That's all I'm doing, really, being a super weirdo. Hi, Frank. It's Mike. I don't believe you. Oh. 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 Do we just play this and next turn equip? Yeah, boy. Yeah, I wanted to keep Dissolve up, but this will do. I'm out in Portland for the GP. Oh, because Andy lives there. Oh, that actually does make sense. Is that this Is that this weekend? That is this weekend, isn't it? Yeah, because I would have gotten back on Monday and then had to leave again on Tuesday. <clears throat> oh, yes. Oh, boy. That means you're not doing anything else this turn. So we can go skin render, kill your Gonti, and then... Oh, we can't equip, though. Dang it. Equipping is the hard part. It's Equipping the hardest part. Equipping is the hardest part. If we draw a two-mana spell, we're good. Like, uh... I'm trying to think of two-mana spells. Snapcaster Mage? No. Like, uh... Is it Charm to kill this, or, uh... Terminate? Mind Control, I guess, is a thing. I like actually we can discard champion of wits here. Yeah, we get to untap our lands. I'm talking about being able to do something with this two mana before we untap the lands, though. I'm trying I'm talking about maximizing our mana. Yeah, you guys don't understand. Clearly, you guys don't understand what I'm saying, so maybe it's my fault. Maybe I'm not being clear here. I would love to, to be able to kill this with an Izzet Charm and then untap all of our lands to keep up either Dissolve or Skin Render. That's what I'm saying to you. I'm I'm not saying I'm not gonna be able to do these things at all. I'm saying I'd like to make use of this two mana that's on the board. You could have double equipped. That's called the dequip. But you're right, I could have done that. I don't think I care about either of these, really. Maybe I care about this. What do they take from us, though, is the question. I don't think I care. Kill it. Most of our removal is black, so... Oh, they didn't even loot. They must have a good grip. <clears throat> what did you say? Is mostly black? What? Hmm? Most of the removal is black for this. Yeah, yeah right. So whatever they got probably isn't going to kill that guy. They could steal it, and then we'll just move the move the boy. How are they going to steal it? They could put. They could mind control it. We have mind control in our hand. Well, why can't they have it? Oh, if you had their own, you it's mean... It's a league, not... yes. I was talking about, like, Gaunti spells. Oh, no, I'm just talking about in their deck. Are they going to fatal push? Are they going to have to crack the Terramorphic Expanse to kill this guy? Doomblade's dead. That's actually amazing. <laughs> that's, that's crazy. Uh, you know what else is crazy, though? We could hostage shake her this. Mm -hmm. And then cast it. We could also just mind control it. Either way it works. Yeah. It's a pretty good...
Man, Afghanistan's crazy, dude. How crazy is it? It's pretty crazy, man. I'll make this trade. But will they? I don't know. So I think they're arming a fatal push here. It looked like they had fatal push last turn and they just didn't want to. They, they realized they couldn't kill this with it. And fatal push. Yep. So they were saving it to revolt. I mean, I don't know if we do we loot. I guess we don't have an option to loot. We always loot, right? Yeah. Yes. Um, I'm going to get rid of this. Don't need it. I do not need. God, being able to keep up counterspell mana. They have one card and then whatever card they exiled from us. Fascinating. I'll just keep up the... Oh, we can also activate Tassir, which is pretty gas if they don't do anything. <coughs> How gassy is it? Like some hot fots. Gross. Is it gross? Oh, Glenelg or Archmage? No, thank you. Uh, nay. Oh, they just can see. They're like, yep, that'll do. <laughs> that'll do, pig. Unblockable sword is good, they say. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I don't know what's boarding against them, so I'm just going to submit like this. Okay, good talk. Board in, um... Don't tell me what to do. Okay, fine. Ugh. Oh, God, I'm basically dead. Oh. Hey, man, how much are... How, what are we talking to squirt this in your mouth? No one's offered up any prizes yet. Any prizes? <laughs> oh man I would do it for the right price Mitch have you actually been there four times is that true oh that looks good I, it does dude Magiano's just sent me an advertisement like a, a, an email and uh let's see if I can save this image just, just, just open it. I don't want to. How do I open? Open. View image. I did that, and that's what he tries to like save it. I guess we'll just save it. And I'll just move these guys. And I'll bring it over here. And I'll move this back. And I'll bring this back. And this is what the image was. <laughs> so it's like, I'm like, oh wow, that looks ridiculous. If we just need buddies to go to Magiano's now. Look at that beauty. Who wants to volunteer to go to Magiano's with us tomorrow? 11 years in the army. I had no idea, dude. Anyone want to go to Magiano's tomorrow? I'll go. We do family style. Yeah, you did. Because I read it. I read you say, you'll take my Mio, but I'll take yours too. You'll squirt the Mio, but I'll drink you full. Yeah. And it's now it's in my head. I didn't want to read it out loud because I didn't think you deserved it. But I did it anyway. Scroll down the chat, man. Oh, I forget. Nick, come visit. We'll go to Family Style, bro. How come we haven't gone when you were here? That was a misplay on our part. That was a real misplay. Man, that's like the perfect Nick thing to do. Nick, next time you're here, we're going to Family Style. Confirmed. You had Thanksgiving at Magiano's? Yeah, it's how, a lot of Italian restaurants are open on Thanksgiving, I think. Hmm. Do they serve Turkums? No, dude. They serve Italian food. <laughs> what about what about Turkums? Are you sure they don't have some kind of Turkum dish? Yeah, it's turkey parmesan. Ooh, delicious. No, it's not. I bet turkey parmesan would be just fine. Just one bird for another. One bird for another. One good bird deserves another. Do we just rack us for two? No, we can wait. Oh, but this? Arg. 
Turkey Alfredo. Yeah, it's Turkey Alfredo. They have uh, four cheese turkey raviolis. Turkey meatballs? <laughs> that's a real thing, though. <laughs> that's like, not even crazy, though. Yeah, that's actually a real thing. Um, mm, turkey Alfredo. Look, man, all I'm saying is you took a turkey breast and deep fried it with some breadcrumbs and then put some red sauce on it and some cheese. It would be good. I don't know if it would be, though. Like, turkey and chicken don't taste that similar. I'd eat a turkey parm. Yeah, but... I've also ate shrimp parm, which was a little weird, but it tasted good. That looked weird when I saw it. Turkey, turkey bread soup. parm, but the part breading is actually stuffing. Ooh. I'm actually afraid of this Underworld connection, so that is a strong boy. All right, we're going to push that dude right into the garbage can. BRB making some turkey parm. I don't actually know what... Turkey parm, but the breading is stuffing and the sauce is cranberry sauce. That's just regular Thanksgiving, basically. That's literally... That's not even correct. <laughs> that's literally just turkey with stuffing and cranberry sauce. <laughs> Oh my god, why are you the way that you are? I hate everything that you choose to be. That cat's still making noises. That kid is back on the escalator. Name that movie. I can't. It's Mall Rats, Michael. When me and Rob did that Battle Bond event, I opened these guys in my prize packs. Again? Man, you're like a master of that. Yeah, we're, we're, I'm, I'm good at it. Thanks for thanks for acknowledging my skills. Wait, what did they do? Nothing? I'll take your life, but you'll take mine too. I'll fire the musket and I'll run you through. Do we play this and risk it for the La Biscuit? They have three mana up. They could do all kinds of shenanigans here. This gets countered for sure, right? Faux show. Sure. If they don't, I think we win this game. Okay, they're cycling. That's actually better. Because now they're far more limited in their options. Oh, honey buskets. <laughs> oh, six damage, pro black. Untap the lands. Rakdos return you for four. The game just ended, I think. Oh, God. it's Oh, oh they also lose a card from this. Yes. They'll be left with one card. Oh, boy. Turkey parm, but the turkey is ramen in the bar. <laughs> American wow. cheese. Oh, this is not what Richard and <laughs> want. Oh, that's just perfect. Oh, this is gonna... It's gonna get worse before it gets better, my, my friend. Manate. Manate. Oh, you get to keep one card. And you... Hey, Mike, how are you doing with the rat debt? Um, That's why I play poker, to pay it off slowly. Yeah, he actually goes further into rat debt, but then he, he, he earns enough to, to counteract that. Oh, good games. Oh, I was gonna... It's, it's, it's lagging because of the concession. Good games. Uh, good games. All right, we did it. Two oh oh two. All right, let's see if we can finish this off with a, with a big old two one. No, what's the what's the word? A big old. I was gonna say a big old goose egg. That's what people say, but that would be a loss. And I that don't would want be that. bad. Why would you want that? I don't. I just said that. It's like you're not even listening to me. Unbelievable. Yeah, well, I kind of tune you out. So Rakdos return is what Richard Garfield wanted. I'm not so sure. Oh, Kigaro, that is the that is the manifest bug. Stop stop hovering over that card and you'll be fine, but uh, it's still not ideal. I kept this hand. How do you feel about that? It's a good hand. Uh, how do you feel about Belschnickel? We don't have him in this game. Are you impish or admirable? <laughs> <laughs> impish or admirable? Impish. What do you say? What, is, what does he say then? I don't remember. Okay, good talk. Good talk. You don't remember either, so screw you, buddy. Your mother... Doesn't know anything. 
Got him. Got him. Got him real good. What do we play? A looter or is it segment? Oh, I guess what? We'll, I guess we'll have to wait and find out. I mean, Richard Garfield wanted mind twist. Mind twist is a hell of a drug. <clears throat> so every card I manifest is a worthless dude that I can't attack. No, the only it usually doesn't happen to all of them. In my experience with Whisperboard Elements, it only happened to one of the of the tokens. Oh, they took that. So I guess we're just playing this, maybe. Hey Mike, you like shrimp parm? Yes, yes I do. Which it's is weird good. because why? It's just real good. I don't. Is it real good or is it? Where just do good? shellfish borrow money? I don't know. Where do shellfish borrow money? At the I don't know. At the prawn shop. That's actually wow. Really good. <laughs> Jesus. Oh Jesus. The C bank. Come on. That's literally just adding where they live on, on bank. It's like you're not even trying. Under the bank. <laughs> under the bank. Are you under the bank? Our hand's pretty good. I like I like our hand. Also, if they're predominantly black, that's sort of feast and famine. Muy bueno. <laughs> Muy bueno indeed. Oh, you know what we should do in Nixon Town next time? Tell me. Maggiano's? We'll go to Maggiano's. Okay. And then we'll, fin then we'll, and then we'll go to dinner, too, at takes Texas Day Brazil. I can't. <laughs> I can't do this. Oh, Mike, yes. It's going to be an expensive day. Can we live stream the whole thing? Yes. You can live stream us vomiting. <laughs> Here comes Soren. Six mana Soren. Wow. How does he do it? I don't know. He's just a... Where do shrimp get drunk? Lucky, 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 shrimp lucky, get drunk? Lucky. Drunk. Donald Drumpf? <clears throat> the sandbar. Hmm. Well done. Huh. Mike was like, huh. Well, we don't have a targets for this and don't have any targets for this. I guess we just attack for one. They only have two cards. Not terrible. Remember that time I predicted the Soren for six? No, you did? Yes, I said they're going to play Soren for six. And then I said lucky, lucky, lucky after. That's exactly what they did. Is that not good enough for you? No. Are you not entertained? A little. You're a little entertained? Yeah, a little bit. Are you not a little entertained? Shrimps would never drink shrimp cocktails. First of all, you don't drink shrimp cocktails. Shiv and fire. I didn't know Second of all, cube. that's cannibalism. Why well, they have burst lightning and shiv and fire in the cube? That's weird. This is where they just kill this because they're like, well, you're going to counter anyway. Oh, that's interesting that you're going to give me an opportunity to counter this. You know what? Sure. It's a 1-1. One, one. I prevent you from having two 1-1s. One, that's about as much as I can ask for. Life is... Wow. Chromatic Lantern and Coalition Relic? For a two-color deck? Going mm -hmm. deep. Uh, they're clearly Mardu, Michael. Oh, my bad. You're right. Let's get a watery grave. Oh, I like that. I like that Arid Mesa breeding pool meme. That's a good one. <coughs> my is... Is it charm? Does that do anything? No. Where do birds buy... Oh, yeah, th uh, I can't Where see Where do it. birds buy... Oh, I can't see. Oh, I can't see. Oh, that's the Sky Shoe Store meme. Okay. All right. I think we're just. I think we're just in bad shape. I mean, what's your thought on the new Twitch? I don't even know what that means. What's the new Twitch? There's a new Twitch. Should I be on that?
Get on the new Twitch. Oh boy. Oh boy. Now we might be dead. I'm gonna go to the next game. Boy, I really wish this Terminate was a dread bore. Uh, Alright, so Manic Vandal comes in. Terminate and Fatal Push can leave. I wish this was Planeswalker. Terminate! Uh, Sarkon and Banefire actually seem pretty good here. Mind Control can leave. None of these seem great. Oh, Hexmage seems fantastic. Uh, I think I'm, I think I'm comfortable with 41 here. Like the interface, it's different, really. <clears throat> I have not noticed this, but I also only I don't actually watch it particularly frequently. I'm not seeing a different interface. It looks pretty much the same to me. What if I go to Twitch Home? Twitch Home. That's my home, I guess. I don't know how to I don't know how to navigate Twitch. Twitch is still confusing to me. Oh, this should be the home. This should be just twitch.tv. Think browse. There we go. We did it. It just took a while. Yeah, it looks I don't see anything different to me. This looks the same to me. Uh Barrel's expertise does not bounce Sorn. That it only bounces artifacts and creatures. That is correct, as Mike learned the hard way. The hard way being me telling him, Hey buddy. How do you say race car backwards? The same way you say it forwards. <clears throat> Just have no, to it's car race, stupid. Nick, I get it, buddy. I get it. Funny joke! That was a good draw. It's car race, stupid. Wow. Hey, man, if you never played a spell, that dissolve is terrible. I oh, played a spell. I think we're dissolving this. You think so? Yeah, I don't give a crap about this. Well, then why are you countering it? Because cause I want to. That doesn't make any sense. Shut up. You're terrible. You're terrible. Oh, you can click on what people are doing? So, like, oh, I, interesting, interesting. So, like, it's like YouTube now where it shows you, like, the preview screen. Or, like, the video, the, the, the thumbnail moves when you hover over it. Thought the expertise was a meme by now. Oh no, that's actually fantastic. It's so much better now that I know it was just a meme. Alright, sure. You got it. Well, I can't hostage take or anything, unfortunately. Because also... A YouTube clip, eh? <clears throat> what is this? What is this link? You better not be demonetizing me. I'll be sad. <laughs> That's all Frosty the Frostman. That was a classic. Can't get demonetized if it's your own video. Frosty. Oh, you're going to tap down that. Oh, well. I got some bad news for you, Chief. Do you know what the bad news is? What are you hoping to get from Belschnickel this year? My dad. Oh, that got real sad. Well, I got news for... Oh, butter my biscuits. Can you butter my biscuits? Kill this guy. I'm eating pieces of old cheddar. Old cheddar, interesting. And drinking mango nectar. Hmm. What would Mannequin do? Man, these are solid memes. These are top tier memes you guys are, you guys are spitting. <laughs> you should get back the uh, assemble the legion oh soren in the graveyard karn in the graveyard wow they discarded a soren and a karn that's pretty nice uh 
Uh, I feel like I've switched out the backgrounds pretty regularly. I'm actually due for switching this one out. It's been a while. I like kind of neutral... Um, I like kind of neutral backgrounds that kind of go with anything, not just magic. Oh, well. Um, so actually what we can do is... Yeah, this is actually pretty good. We're going to go towards your Elspeth. And then we're going to steal it with Zealous Conscripts. And then we're going to kill all the big creatures. And we leave ourselves... Um, I like how he did that before attacking. I guess they would have just probably triple blocked. What would we have stolen? Oh, I guess we could have stolen this guy. Oh, yeah, that's true. I was thinking... Yeah, no, I was thinking like... So here's my train of thought for that. I was like, oh, we can steal the Elspeth, but that doesn't do anything because we're not going to be able to kill her if we steal it. We can't attack her. So I'll steal her after the attacks. Uh, and it totally... Fuck, I didn't even cross my mind that I could steal something different and do that. We could have just stolen a token and, and attacked her. Or no, but then they wouldn't have had her. They would have still had her. Yeah, we're done. I don't know what I'm saying right now. Anyway, I'm just killing the Elspeth. We had to steal Elspeth is the point. So so we could have done it pre-combat and then attacked with this guy as well. But then they could triple block and... Oh, boy. Yep. Boy, they never don't have it, do they? Man, if only we ever got to counter something with our Glen and Dark Mage. You're right. If only. If only. Looks like we're off to the races, boys. We're legit off to the races. Races just got real good. Pretty good at flyers. Unless their last card. Oh my god, are you serious right now? <sighs> Jesus, that's it's unbelievable. Ridiculous. Triple block? Actually, fine, sure. Wow, I'm just like, my, my mind is like blown from that. They just had to have like one mana removal spell there. And I guess it didn't have to be one man, but like they had to draw a removal spell there. So it was literally like Elspeth into Assemble into Lightning Bolt. There's a lot of, a lot of impressive things happening here. Let's see if you have it again. How about that? Do you have it this time? Wow. Lucky, 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 lucky. It's amazing. This is a real thing that's happening in the real world. Okay. One more top deck. Let's see if you got another one. Let's see. You got one more. You got one more. <clears throat> okay. Let's try again. It did. It worked. Okay. So we're going to go Vizier. Copy the Nighthawk. Well, whatever it is, they're going to discard it, which is weird that they chose not to uh, play it. Unless it is actually like a, a removal spell, but it doesn't. it's not black or white. So they're just going to... Okay, damage is being dealt. I don't know. Even if it's a land, like I think you should have still... Oh, that makes sense now. <laughs> so it actually was a removal spell, comically enough. We just happen to have black <clears throat> creatures. Um, so now we just get to turn to Gear Hulk with Dissolve up, and I think that's probably going to be game. Uh, I have no idea. Zaichi, I don't know what that is, but I'm afraid to download it. 
However, I do kind of trust you, so... Alright. Snappy boy. Oh, snappy boy. Do we care about Champion of Woods here? I don't think so. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just attack him. Actually, we can Rakdos' return their face. For like two. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Well, they have no cards in hand, actually, so we could definitely play something pre-combat. Like, we can actually hostage take one of these guys or something. I'd rather just play champion once you're going to do that. Well, I don't really want to discard, though. I guess we keep that up. Uh, when I opened this, when I opened, when I clicked on this link, it actually tried to download the file, so... I didn't get an image. Oh, that's fine. It's very. I feel like it's very rare when you get to actually beat a, an active assembled legion. But life link and flying is no joke. Pretty good. Pretty good, as Mike would say. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and we have a counter spell for your one card. In also twenty nine. So, despite having it all, you don't have enough. Jesus, the, the the Elspeth into Assemble and the Lightning Bolt into Shivan Fire was pretty tilting, I'm not going to lie. Alright, I'm clicking this. What is... <laughs> oh, because the high beams, like reverse high beams? What is that from? Like, is that... What is, what is that connected to, though? Um... Do we like? I wish we had an answer. I wish, th I wish these colors, black, blue, and red, had an answer to... Uh, Enchantments? Assembled Legion, yeah. I'm just they like, don't. well, they don't. Thank you. You're welcome. They also have infinite planeswalkers, but no real no real creatures that we saw. Burst Lightning could be good in that in that case. Oh, we could have snapped first. I actually wasn't thinking about that. I was thinking more in terms of uh Torrential Gear Hulk. Like I forgot that you can actually float the mana with snapcaster but i think we're actually fine maybe we take out vizier for burst lightning i actually like that because Bur burst lightning can kill planeswalker whereas vizier is going to likely be copying our own guys a lot of the time blind driver's behind you with the big light yeah I, I, I know but like what does that have to do with the i feel like is that connected in some way to our chat this seems like a mulligan to me it's not a good hand except for the colors but yeah, this is good. Definitely better. <coughs> I don't actually care about this guy. I know wow. that's weird, but... So rude. Was it rude? Super rude. Was it? Yes. Oh, this is my signet. Where's my signet? Right there. That's not it. Are you sure? Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Dissolve. Oh, you're a frost titan. I don't want either of these now. That's unfortunate. I'll leave with this in case we draw land. We can play this guy. If we don't, we can play this guy. It's fine. Main phase cycle. Look for that land. Me too. Got there. All right, one time, one time, Night Vale Predator. Do your, do your, do your business. It's totally dead. It's not Here goes dead. You. Yeah, never didn't have it. I wish Hostage Taker could steal Planeswalkers. That would be nice. That would be pretty good. <laughs> oh my god, dude. 
Oh, man. Oh, is this their recommended fix? Yeah, so, like, I have a Roomba. I bought a Roomba off of, like, Black Friday. It was, like, 250 I already have one robot vacuum, but there's, like, a step in our house. So I have one for another for another area. Uh, and I was like, this is a good deal. It's a Roomba. It's, like, your, it's like the high-end, the, the high like, vacuum choice. Um, so I was like, okay, cool. I'll just get one of these. Turns out, the Roomba, the one I got, the 690 has a known issue where if it sees black on like a carpet or a floor it the sensors on the bottom perceive that as a cliff and it's unable to actually go past that area so it gets stuck and it's like oh no i can't do anything right now and then i get notifications on my phone where it's like roomba is stuck go help it and i'm like i i i it's just literally going over the carpet so (laughs) i mean like and their their solution was like you should just block off that area and uh you know just have it avoid. i'm like this the carpet literally covers the entire living room it's like a 90 square foot carpet and i'm like this is actually why i bought it because i wanted it to vacuum the living room so it's weird that you're telling me the 300 dollar vacuum can't vacuum the living room and to not do it i'm like it seems like in 2018 this is a pretty unreasonable uh choice for a vacuum uh, I'm going to keep your red tap down. And um, alternatively, like, so they were like, hey, yeah, we do have a, I'm like, so do you have any recommendations of a different model I can upgrade to? And they're like, hey, our our i7 plus, uh, what does it say? It's like, with your role being less than we can in trouble for you from Amazon, if any interest, uh, our, we launched our i7 plus, which is perfect for behaviors like these. The i7 plus let's see let me see actually i'm looking at the regular i7 the i7 plus is jesus 949 dollars jesus <laughs> like so wait just to be clear you want me to get a 700 hundred dollar vacuum or a 700 hundred dollar more vacuum This is where they go Doomblade. Oh, they don't go Doomblade. Do I care about? I don't. Do I care about a Johnny? I want to be able to untap. No, we're going to, if we, if we actually resolve this, uh, we're going to play Nicol Bolas. So. This, this, if this resolves, oh my God, this is going to connect. We get to just untap all our lands and play Nicol Bolas and kill her a Johnny. Oh my. Do we even care about that? Yeah, because they can target this guy. Wow. We can also just have them discard two cards from their hand. I don't want them to have lightning. Oh, it doesn't matter if they have lightning bolt because they have black cleave clips tapped down. So, yeah. All right. So we have Nicol Bolas and Frost Titan with a pearl black. Seems good. <laughs> oh my god, that does it <laughs> by itself. Wow. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Patreon and Twitch. Links are in the description below. And as usual, if you guys are looking for some sweet deals, you can check out Aaron Kane Custom Deck Boxes. The links are in the description and my Twitch profile. Uh, you get 10% off any uh, any of the orders in Aaron Kane's store. His stuff is absolutely incredible. I recommend you check it out. And uh, if you get any custom orders, you can mention me, and then he'll give you, like, free engraving or something like that. So uh, definitely definitely really sweet. If you're in the market for something like that, especially with Christmas coming, check that out. And you can go to MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore, and you will get 15% off and free shipping and free returns. Again, awesome stuff for the holidays. So if you guys need something like that, if you're going to get it anyway, definitely use my affiliate link. It helps me out. It supports the stream, and you get a discount. So thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. I will check you next time. See you later.